Shalom Ambazonia. Good morning. Today, na Saturday, number 26 day for this month of August 2023. My name na Kapo Daniel, wuna own countryman, sense pass king, Mr. No Kony, wuna welcome to our daily podcast, a program where they bring una the truth. It bring una meaningful information, fact-based analysis for help we as we work out through this journey to our freedom, to the independence of Ambazonia. Our good people of Ambazonia across the globe, while our people them they, they be distracted with internal politics, trying to get credit here and there, like the public to come around, they will be focused on the issue we matter most for the people for ground zero the education of our children september it come it day only for our dumut la republic it put out a warning and a campaign the first one that i'm conduct football matches them across ambazonia for plenty area them seven specific area they will they make huge celebration of football disguise football as a way for bring our population mid and listen for them we don't see them for Insta Tuba, we don't see them for Lebialem, we don't see them for Wum, we don't see them for other places, them, including Moyoka, where the video na the latest one we happened yesterday for Friday. These issues na the real battleground for the freedom of Ambazonia. If you no be in touch with Ground Zero, you go know say that these things that they actually make or break this our struggle. While those in America then be focused for Sako against Cristiano and their own cabal for court case. They don't forget and they don't lost touch for which will happen for ground zero. Other activists them, either they don't married or they don't begin to do their normal things them. They the way media friend they make mistake, me then jump on top for shout on it. The militants where they don't become transformed into partisan. They the way media own group or miss on group way they feel like at their group. It takes some action. Me then claim them. For the most part, we Ambazonian, we have been derailed from the liberation struggle. We have lost touch with our reality and the zeal to pursue our dream for a free homeland have diminished significantly. Not because our people do not want freedom, but because with the changing time and as time have gone by, our leaderships and groups have failed to put before our people any tangible plan that is even believable or that is workable on ground zero. The Maurice, at least Bo Herbert is bereaved, but have been almost mute. Their main channel to propagate and motivate our people, the Ambazonian calling, have since gone silent. John Baokuru is more concerned about the internal politics of La Republic du Cameroon, which are very interesting, but less in terms of of generating attacks against the Cameroon military. While Ayabacho is there trying to lure forces so that he can call himself the overall commander of all forces in Ground Zero. All these things are going on while the table is being switched under our feet with less and less attention from the Ambazonian people. We should know that this struggle is not about group. It's not about anybody dominating. It is about our own people. And when we lose focus on ground zero, on what is happening on ground zero, that is when the devil works hard and hardest to defeat us. All Ambazonian groups, all Ambazonian activists should rekindle their love and find back their mojo. The only reason they are losing their mojo is that they have failed to evolve with time. They have failed to meet up the challenge of time. Ambazonians should be able to assess at every moment are we going to win this war? Are our strategy working? What are the things that we expected to happen for us to win this war? The greatest hope for Ambazonia had been the support or the consensus within the international community that La Republic du Cameroon had reacted in an illegal manner, killing our people. Cameroon had been indicted for crimes against our people and that has given us hope that our case will be heard by the international community. We have messy that ground. We need to clean up that ground and make sure we present to our people a route forward, a way forward that is attainable so that their heart 
should be warm again for the fight for their country. If you look at what happened in Tuba, you look at what happened in Wum and all these places that I've cited, you see the warning which I have been given to our people. Our internal politics will make us one day to wake up and open our eyes when those defenders of our land are no longer there to make the statements and to empower us to fight for our people. We will come back to that. But first, we want to see how the information is the rule and how the war is the change. The United States of America, they don't arrest their former president. Something we you know forever expect say, a big and leading country like the United States of America, they go fi get a president where he go fi become a criminal. They accuse Donald Trump, say if he talks to me, some he supporter them, then fine vote them. They do interpret that one saying a crime, if he mean I say if he talks to me, then go make up vote them where they exist. Because of that allegation, where the nobody prove them, they don't arrest him based on that interpretation by the prosecutor, a whole former president. He then begin, they then begin treated like a common criminal, put it for inside prison where they put thieves them for inside. The timing for prosecute Donald Trump it be very very suspicious because say the recashing at time where election it come. Since the last election, years and years they don't pass where any prosecutor will be one prosecutor because of a crime will be committed for that make the case long ago. So the CC even the America will be the look upon them says up. They don't begin to say they not be the beacon of democracy. Show say politics is there for inside way to way their government is do them, including their judiciary. A good thing, say every man way is there for country is supposed to be under the law. No man not supposed to be above the law. So for put Donald Trump for, for trial, it could be a very good thing. But before you put a whole former president for inside court or for prison, the reason must really be strong, must be tangible. Irrefutable evidence will not be based on interpretation on what somebody said, which can also be seen as a political statement. In this, we see America as a declining democracy. America is being at the country where most developing country in the world they be expecting if their own government is the one for punish political leader them or opposition, say they the one challenge election. America don't always be the hope for stop any dictator say you must allow political parties for be able for challenge election in any way they choose for do them including for protest for street and including the use of violence and disobedience of law or which way they call and say civil disobedience today america iran lost that voice because if them say that they get the kind of problem then now we go to stand before for begin caution other country they may not begin to do the same thing in this case you remember we of mogan shangaria he and Robert Mugabe, the American government, they do exactly the same thing with Mugabe, if they do them. Interpreting political speech to carry out political persecution. Nevertheless, we see also for Russia, Prigozhin, one of that big, big strong fighter them, when Naibi stand up for raise private army, me don't go fight for Bakhmut, for show the war and for show Ukraine, say Russian is still get in Kanda, he don't die for inside plane crash. Where all man is accused now Putin, saying that Putin Iran kill him. Because for inside Russia, every strong opposition leader, either they poison you or they will don't make some kind of way you die. So Prigozhin is dead. It reminds us, say, any dictatorship or any government where your job now for kill people the way they oppose you, you know, will ever be stable. Because for the first time, the Russian president will be in a state of insecurity. You don't know who says some Wagner forces they go come out because that Wagner forces they be get big people for inside Russian military, inside their intelligence for high places, then where they be able for even try for make coup d'etat for a whole Russia. Today, the president it will be less safe. There is more uncertainty within the Russian population, according to polls, the way they release them, people they be worried and the ruble it will drop, it will drop for down. The takeaway thing we Ambazun and the need for learn. Now say, for kill your political opponent, for persecute your political opponent, it is wrong and does not benefit any collective people. The root for any prosperity and development for any government, even during a war, now for stick along principle them with the uphold upright people. Burkina Faso, that means country of upright people. We must be upright in our character and conduct for we for able to be successful. The infighting them will get them today now because of our inability to accept 
differences, challenges, or even somebody it be better than other people in certain field. Ambazonian Idan specialize for begin try for bring down, even assassinate their political opponent. It then create the chaos who they inside today, the implosion where our struggle it go through because of such primitive instincts. Then we will see them for dictatorships. When you look La like Republic, then stand up for inside square for inside Moyoka, they talk rubbish for our population. It will remind you about Captain Sumo Pekin. The strongest and the overall ADF commander will be there for inside Faku, we they be done kill him under mysterious circumstances. Then if the one die, if the complain for me, say I have a cho, if the try for replace he, because if he over follow me. If now some man if he go pass, go kill him, you go feel say you go take away now the influence for Capo Daniel. Before you do one bring down some person, you don't think whether you feel replace that person for inside Moyoka. By now, Captain Small Pekin, if we don't go, if we don't, if we don't send it from school to school, quarter to quarter, for educate our people them on how they need to behave, why they need to go for community school, and for them put everything in a proper way, way if we counter La Republic du Cameroon, their propaganda. Today, it don't die. La Republic, it gain root for inside Moyoka. Now, who it don't benefit? Now, who it don't benefit? When you bring somebody down, with wrong things them you make up story you lie about people just for bring them down no thing say you go benefit ambazonia in any shape or form we don't say amwarana from the first day way this our struggle is start way for leaders for emerge they go bring down the other one them around me or for other leader them for try for also counter the leader way they for top they will try for sabotage for climb for on top at the end of the day when you destroy everybody you stand there you'll be alone and nobody will be there to help you for the country to be free because nobody can free Ambazonia by themselves. My fellow Ambazonian, we must stand up for principles. We must all be vanguards of our liberation movement. Wherever you are, wherever you can have a voice, always speak and uphold the truth. Always challenge those who spread lies, blackmails, threat against our people for no good reason. Those things will never win those things will never enable us to win. Even if it has short-term benefits at the long run, it is only going to destroy our liberation struggle. And once more, I will come back again for the issue of liberation tax. Liberation tax is a very, very good idea, but it must not be misused as a political tool. And I will advise all our soldiers and everybody for Ground Zero. When I remember, say most of our mamidem, how the struggle be start? They, they used to cook chop, or they do work farm. They go send someone for the boys them in the bush, for support the meat and get chop for chop. People they, they, they do business. They be done always they donate at their own free will. Today, make wanna know the best way for we for sustain our liberation. Now stay through this free will. If any soldier you decide say you go go begin tax every man. Every woman, you start picking your phone call. First of all, you don't get that capacity for do You go to the corner, the people the way you know them, and the people where they know you. Then people where they be connected with you, they go begin to see you say you've been a liability because now for Grand Zero, people no first get money for chop. And once they start see you like a liability and like a threat, you will become compromised in your security because you don't know who size of man you will go get bad heart for protect you 10,000, it will go sell you. So I go advise all soldier. Make wanna no attempt for do general collection for tax because we not get that capacity in the first place. If some man they push and for una, una go try him, he go fail and he, now we go loss. We no get that capacity for collect general tax. If we want collect tax now the people where they close to it now they go suffer and other people they go feel sell we. We na begin take support for mami them according to una relationship for them. If we man give una chop, una take and chop. We na focus for tax. For people the way that they make substantial money for economic activity the way they be substantial i be done put and say so amount of money the way some company need for make them even for small small bad them for quarter you did take support for them based on the type of money where they feel make them that way they know say you did do not the right thing and you must get way for be accountable you know if you go collect money the chop and you want no man no know what and how much you collect them or now you and who the chop them or you need, you need to even correspond with your action where you take them you don't want to go collect money, tax 
na tax where they collect them for do things of a public. You go collect money your own for do it today. How fight? How much better you fight for Ambazonia? How many times you fight? Think about them and make sure say if you do want demand or you do want go collect, it will be based on those things the way you do them or things the way you plan for do them. Where when you go do them, all man go no say at least they be done give their money. It no be waste enough for waste. Any abuse get a consequence. Put them for your head. Any abuse get a consequence, a repercussion, and things the way you know if calculate them. So tax na good thing, but make sure say you use wisdom how will you do an approach them. No generalize something and not compare Ambazonia with Eritrea. Because Eritrea and all those places, they will be them well organized. They be down whole territory the way they, they control them so they get their own currency. They be being an upright people, them, their leader, them, you know, be the year say they begin my trip to Boya or all this corruption will get them for Ambazonia. They be the collect money to stay for inside Eritrea, for Somaliland. You go for the people, they, they, they do money exchange, bank them, they, they open road, they don't get security. But for we Ambazonia, some more money won't pass for our hand, you don't hear either na jealousy or na criminal that don't take and chop them. So, when I be wise, maybe when I not begin mistake people their campaign, political campaign, for reality and then when I want to apply them it go cost when I, when I go enter shock so me gonna be wise me will be one who we'll spread love amongst ourselves first reconcile our population with our soldiers first then everything will be okay make no soldier in no try for use force or excess power because you want to collect money the poverty for ground zero now now hilly and of it Use what for explain how people they did for ground zero, the life of people they go through. Even Ambazonian soldier them. So we need to be very careful. We need to understand the dynamic. Right now, La Republic is the campaign for the heart and mind of our people them. Especially how we September it come. No be time for you for go begin do some foolish things away. When some shock go enter you, the people the way that they even push you for back, they no go even know, they no go even want for even know. We must resist. And our people, they must get hope so that the resistance it goes strong. From talking to our community with them, for place them where the Republic it doesn't make this campaign them. Many people then go for those campaigns now because they don't want to save their head. They never hear any Ambazonian leader he articulate how we feel win. They look way to where they go for ground. They see so we never get direct tete a tete confrontation with the Republic, the military them. And then they see any way we feel win. And I don't tell our people them. So make we get hope and make we fight with a different ideology. We be attainable. We be believable. We in a thin way it be supported by the international community because not only that support for that international community and their understanding it be done give without hope we will done fight till now. If in other day, make we still get the hope. Say we we'll still win our independence by securing this independence in the future. Right now, we know if you win independence immediately. It no be possible. It no be possible. The international support in no day day. It don't actually be nana against that independence immediately. So if you campaign say so you want immediate independence now, first of all, you know we'll get international support. Secondly, that campaign in the Helm na Pobia, because Pobia go use that one now for be strong head. He go use that one now like, like reason, say the people then just want only independence. It means that any man, me man, no support them. It go isolate our struggle more and more. So any man where he talks will fight now for independence right now. That man done lost sense. You know the follow reality. We the fight for secure our independence in the future. We the fight for resist Cameroon now until we get a just solution where it go preserve our identity and it go make sure say we feel govern ourselves. We feel maintain our flag. La Republic feel decriminalize our identity and our movement. Now, so we fight now. We fight now for resist Cameroon until we get a just solution. If we no fight for this way, our people then first there will be the resolution because there is no attainable map or roadmap or any plan for independence immediately or liberation by military force. Liberation by military force is no longer possible. But we can secure our independence in the future by fighting for a concession now that will preserve a pathway for our independence in the future. We need to change our mindset. For change mindset, no be crime. For change mindset, you know, mean I say you don't compromise. 
as a matter of fact it means that you love independence because you know say if you follow that independence in a foolish way you know will ever even get the chance for get that independence in the future so for preserve our independence we must make this concession now try to see how Ophidius get some middle ground with la republic we need to forget this conversation this conversation will be important because our rhetoric has become part and parcel for the possibility of this negotiation we know if we accept la republic the way we did or which way they didn't offer them for we we can never ever live with them like that so we must continue to resist but as we resist the reason why we resist is as important as the steam that we will have in fighting for this resistance so maybe we'll make sure so we fight none of a show la republic say they no will ever rule our land they no will ever be able to control our land until we say we go see say the solution it be just this is the hope that will governize our people will governize our soldiers and will give momentum back to our fight to re to reverse the losses that we have seen on ground zero this is the only way and this is the right leadership for our people to follow the greatest threat for our independence come to do come from those who have no brains of their own those who are delusion and those who have been gripped with the black man syndrome the wicked black man syndrome that have made them to be partisan and not to be able to think for the livelihood of our people capo daniel looking out for you signing off